All right, this is the first song of Clara's new album. The song is called Bambi, and the album is called Sling. And this is a bit of a tricky one. There's a lot of chords. So I'll talk you through the structure, then I'll explain um, each individual section and what chords are in there and, and kind of how to play it on the piano. Um, so, okay, to start with the structure. So the intro is the same um, four-bar pattern repeated four times, so total 16. Then you get a verse, but the verse only comes back once. Like, there's only one verse in the song. Um, and that goes for eight bars. Then you get the first of what I call the vamp. And so the vamp is this eight bar pattern that comes back four times throughout the song, um, kind of serving a different purpose each time. So the first vamp kind of feels like a pre-chorus. It's like leading us into a chorus. Um, okay, so you've got intro, verse, vamp, chorus. Okay, then we go back to the vamp, but this time it's like an instrumental. Um, then we have another chorus. Then we go back to the vamp again, but this time the vamp kind of feels like a verse. Um, then straight out of that vamp verse, we go into the bridge, and that's 16 bars. Then back to the vamp again. This time it kind of feels like an outro. And then there is a real outro, which is the last kind of eight bars. Okay, so let's start with the intro. So the intro, remember, is a four bar loop that repeats four times. Um, so the first two bars of that loop have a D in the bass, and the next two bars have an E in the bass. So nice and simple. Um, we're in the key of A, so that's chord four and chord five. Um, okay, and then on top of that, we've got this little kind of hook. So it goes, so kind of like an E over D, down to D. So one, one, two, three, four, two, three, four, and then, so G sharp, A, G sharp, A, B. other stuff going on all these like vocal harmonies and whatever but that's kind of the the main basis of it and that hook doesn't get played every single time of those four repeats but that's kind of the main structure so we do that four times two three four two three and just say this is the last time two three four this is little thing leading into the verse okay and so the first, so the verse is eight bars. The first four bars of the verse are the same as the intro. So it's just that hook again. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. The same. And then we're trying to get to F sharp minor. That's going to be the um, bar five chord in the verse. To get there, we go from E put an F sharp in the, uh, sorry, an F in the bass, leading up to that F sharp. So it's like. So F sharp minor, B7, then D over A, so A in the bass, D on top. Then that top D just steps down to a C sharp, so it's like a D major seven over A kind of, so it's like. So it's like D over A, D major seven over A, and kind of, kind of like a B minor. It's got an E being played. It's a bit unclear. Something like that. Some kind of B minor four chord. Okay, so that's the verse. I'll play the whole verse. So it's. get to the first time through the vamp and this is time I said it feels like a pre-chorus so the vamp is going to be like an A with a bit of a B feeling so like a A sus 2 you could call it with an A in the bass and then same chord in the right hand with a G on the bass and then keep that same chord in the right hand now with an F sharp on the bass so it's just stepping down then Kind of like an E6, I guess you'd call it. Different times when they play the vamp, they do different things with this last chord. 
but it's always some form of E, E6, A over E, something like that. Again, it's a bit unclear. There's different instruments kind of playing different things. Um, and then you just do that again, and that's the vamp. So the full vamp, eight bars. First chord is a little tricky. There's the um, the bass is kind of playing a little riff, the little lick in the bottom, so there's no clear bass note. But I think it's kind of like an F sharp minor. And then they hit this really nice chord, which is I think of it as like an E over D, pretty much. So similar to the chord in the intro. The full thing, I think it's got the major seven and the two in here really rich chord so it's like do, 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 that part and then it's like the second half of the hook so it's okay so that's the first four bars of the chorus then we get that same trick again of F leading up to F sharp B7 okay and now these last two bars of the chorus a little bit tricky it'll be so it's kind of like an A sus2 on top and the bass is going so B, A so it's like bum, bum. something like that so this is kind of like a B but without a third so again sometimes they put in that third sometimes they put in the minor third it's a bit all over the place um, something like that Okay, so I'll play that full chorus again. So it's like boom, 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 boom. Something like that. Okay, and then we're back to the instrumental. Remember, this is just the vamp. like a D this time it's a bit unclear okay then we get another chorus two three four so this part F F sharp minor and then this uh, bum, 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 bum. so that's the chorus okay and now we go to the third time through the vamp. So remember the first time through the vamp is kind of like a pre-chorus. The second time through the vamp is kind of like an instrumental. And then this one feels almost like a verse. Um, so you get that boom, 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 that melody. I told all my friends. So this part, A over G, over F sharp, E, same again. getting to the bridge so the bridge is really cool it, it's like a key change so we're going to change keys from a to f sharp so from a major to f sharp major but the first chord of the bridge is actually a b so it's like chord four back to chord one so the end of that um vamp going into the bridge sounds like this so it's like So key change, F sharp, C sharp. Okay, so that chord's really nice. That's like the major three chord. So because we're in the key of F sharp, that's going to be A sharp major, or really A sharp seven, but this time with a D in the bass, or it's really like a C double sharp or D in the bass. Okay, and you probably guessed it, that's leading to D sharp minor. Okay, so it's similar to that um, 
like in the in the chorus or at the end of those vamps, how the F leads to the F sharp minor. This time it's kind of like a D leading to a D sharp minor. Okay, so I'll play the first four bars of the bridge again. So it's. just steps up so it becomes like an F sharp 7 over E back down to the D sharp minor then the bass steps down so it's like a F sharp augmented over D kind of so so from so F sharp over C sharp Okay, so I'll play that bridge again. Two, three, four. F sharp. C sharp. This chord. D sharp minor. F sharp seven over E. D sharp minor. F sharp augmented, so. Okay, then the rest of the bridge. The next four bars are the same as the first four bars. So C sharp, A sharp. Okay, now this is where it gets different. So last time we went to this F sharp seven over E, but this time we're gonna go to very beautiful chord. It's kind of like an E9, so like an E7 with the F sharp. And then with this raised 13th, so it's kind of like an E sharp 13, I guess you'd call it. Very beautiful chord. I can play it all day. Um, yep, so from the D sharp minor, you go to this chord, back to D sharp minor, then you, you get like a D major 7 leading back to A so back to our home key of A so the bridge is finished and we've kind of finished our um, key change to F sharp so we're going back to A so whew, that's a hell of a bridge so I'll play that whole bridge full 16 bars um, going from like the end of the vamp leading into the bridge so end of the vamp Bridge, F sharp, C sharp, D sharp minor, F sharp seven, D sharp minor, stepping down, B, F sharp, C sharp, this chord again, D sharp minor, now this one. Sorry, I messed that up. Back to the D sharp minor. Then. So, D major leading back to A. Now in the vamp again. So, this time the vamp kind of feels like an outro, right? Then, then this time in the vamp, there's this beautiful harmony leading up to like. Kind of like an A major 9. Now we can the same chord through the vamp. Then we're getting near the end of the song. So there's a little, like it goes back down to just piano and bass. And it's A. A over G sharp. A over G. F sharp minor 7. Then there's like a D. D minor, so like chord four, chord four minor, ends back on A, that's the end of the song. <laughs>